everyone, this is Bevan with Denim Geek. I am here with my good buddies Ming Chen and Mike Zapsik of Comic Book Men. Wave! We... No. We are at the most famous comic book store, I would say, in the world. Would you? Arguably, yes. You're, you're absolutely right, Bevan. This is Kevin Smith's Jay and Silent Bob Secret Stash. So, welcome. So, basically the, uh, the corner store of any comic book store. Uh-huh. Comics. No way. Yeah, uh, we've been wow. open since 1997, is that correct? So 1997, do, yes. Do the math at me because I'm not good at it. That's 21 year, years. That's the year the Titanic came out. Oh my god, it, please don't say that. I don't, love the don't Titanic! Say that. I in in comic book and years. And it's pronounced Titanic. So, new this week. All the new issues right here. And that comes out on Wednesdays, usually. Wednesdays, right? yes. You see that these are just waiting for the new comics to come in a little bit later on today. Oh, okay. These are what we call wall books. Okay. They're more expensive than, say, this $3.99 book. Stuff you can't find just anywhere. Do you have any Silver Age books? And we're like, take a look up there. I'm looking for Journey into Mystery number 66. There you go. It's right up there. So Kevin Smith, uh, DC approached him. They said, do you want to do a Batman story? He's like, do I? <laughs> And they let him pick his artist. His artist was Wolf Flanagan. Look at that. That's great. When have you ever seen the Joker with, with hair? Five o'clock shadow. You can have your Batmans and Robins, but no. no Wolf Flanagan no. and Kevin Smith. Yeah, that's yeah, ultimate team up. Guys, they're a little biased. I'm just gonna say. All right. If you look over here, if you watch the TV show Comic Book Man on AMC, this is our show counter. This is right. where we shoot the show. But without all these boxes. No boxes. And uh, the reason we don't actually do business here is uh, shoplifters, I guess, yeah. right? Really? Seriously, because, uh, hey, see you later, thanks for all the stuff I stole. Yeah, yeah. right. Gotcha, gotcha. That's the original window from Jay and Silent Bob's Secret Stash when it opened in 1997. Yes. Really? The year yes. Titanic came out. The year Titanic came out, <laughs> yes. <laughs> if you take a look up, you'll also see Mr. Tusk. Wow. If you go up to it and take a sniff, it smells of Justin Long. That's why I keep my distance. These are Japanese Godzillas from Garage Toys and X Plus. Retail for about between $180 and $220. They just smell like the 70s. What does Wolverine smell like? That's $80. Uh, he smells like desperation and a cash grab. Great. <laughs> Onward. We'll give you a good deal on that too. Hey, 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 easy, sorry, easy. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Easy. Break it, Come on, body. Bevin. 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 Yeah. You could make that into a coffee table for yourself. I maybe. probably could, or a bed. Are you guys gonna get that uh, that hammer? The uh, the axe. Sorry, the axe. Oh, the stormbreaker. Stormbreaker. Are they making a four foot stormbreaker? God, I hope not. <laughs> I can't even get rid of this one. I mean, I would like it. I just don't have. I don't have for this. No, you buy too much already. I yes, know. I do. I've seen him at cons. I do. Dope. Uh, <laughs> cool, I got rid yeah, of that one. This is our life's blood. Yeah. These are trade paperbacks. I actually prefer to read these kinds of books over just the single issues. A lot of people do. Hard to read on the toilet. What is this table? Is this is our podcasting table. Ming and I record I Sell Comics, uh, the weekly comics report back here. And whenever Kevin comes into town, he reports back here. Oh, well, does he really? He does. Well, I like that some of them is like, hey, so-and-so was here. Yeah. yeah. Can I do that too? Sure. I, yeah, there, there's a Sharpie right there. Sure, tag yeah. it up. Yeah. Oh my find god. A, find, I mean, good luck finding a space. But... I will find a space. Okay. Dang it. Hey Ming, I didn't know that Nook was in this b <laughs> No need to get crude. She's just following their wow. lead. So, are these the actual costumes? They're gross. It stinks in there. Who wants to talk about Jesus? I, the Buddy Christ. Probably the centerpiece of the store. Yes, the most iconic piece in here. Everyone wants to take their picture back here with Buddy Christ. And people are always making offers on it. It's like, how much you want to sell that for? Yeah, we're still, I think, What's the um, highest bid on it right now? 40000 40000 I know, yeah, I was like, you cheap <laughs> get out. <Yeah. laughs> What's going on with up there? <sighs> up there. That's actually the blunt mobile that they used in Jay and Silent Bob's right back. And Kevin had his face uh, molded. Mm -hmm. Eerily, uh... Lifelike. Yeah. Kevin purchased this sign. That's the original quick stop sign and now it hangs proudly here. The only thing that I'm bummed about is that we can't get it to light up. Well, couldn't you install something? Nah, it costs money. Okay, great. Guys, thank you so much. This is Ming Chen and Mike Zapsik of Comic Book Men. I am Bevan from Den of Geek. See you guys later.